Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Brett aka Poke Rush, and this is the Poke Rush Collectibles channel and today, oh my goodness, we have some more Vivid Voltage uh, packs we're going to be opening up. I, um, I actually had two of the Elite Trainer boxes and I took the packs out. Um, we are hunting for the Chubby Pikachu because um, my pack luck's not too great and we still haven't pulled one so today's, I'm hoping to be that day. We're looking for either the regular VMAX or the Rainbow Pikachu VMAX, so we're gonna get right into the packs and see what we can do. All right, so I'm gonna get these put to the side. As you can see, we actually have the Elite Trainer Boxes in the background trying to give us some good luck for today's video. Um, yeah, we're jumping right in. We're gonna see what we can do today. Make sure the camera's in focus, here we go. And I say it through every video, but I do give away my code cards in every video. Just make sure you don't take all of them, leave a couple for the next person. And here we go, the first pack. Before we get into it, I just want to say if you enjoy my content, consider subscribing to the channel. We are 9 subscribers away from my 50 subscriber goal before Christmas. So, like I said, if you want to join the community, just hit that subscribe button, maybe smash a like button down below, maybe leave a comment on what you enjoy, maybe what I can do better. But yeah, thanks for watching the video. Let's get right into it. So, we have an energy. We have a Bay, Giraffery, Moo Moo Cheese, Joltik, Sandile, Seedot, Picky Peck, Mudbray, and Electrode, and the first, oh wow, we have a Togekiss V right on the very first, uh, very first pack, very nice. We're not going to take too long on each, on each pack, just because we do have 16 packs in total, two Elite Trainer Boxes, um, I'd like to get through all the packs without any, too many delays. Here's your code card. And we, like I said, we are we are hunting for the chubby Pikachu. Um, I really want to pull the card. I don't really want to buy it online. It feels a lot more natural if I can, you know, pull my cards myself. I mean, I think anybody can go on eBay and, you know, click purchase on a card you like, but I think it feels so much better to actually pull the cards you like by yourself. So that's what we're, what we're kind of trying to do here. We even have the Pikachu pack right here. Maybe this will be the pack. I'd like to know, maybe leave a comment down below if anybody um, in the comments or watching the video has actually pulled the card themselves. I'd like to know. Um, maybe even send me, a, send me a picture on my Twitter or Instagram. Let me see your pulls because I'm always interested in seeing other people's luck because um, I know mine's not that great. We have a Chat Hot, Clubopus, a Skiddo, Shuppet, Pharisee, and there we go. Wow, okay, so this is good, this is good. This is actually really good. Um, I have, I think, four out of the six amazing rares, but I have a lot of doubles. And one of the two I didn't have is Celebi. So this is actually a great pull. I have a bunch of these Elite Trainer boxes. I actually just chose two out of random. Um, but yeah, this is great, this is really good. Um, that's a sick pull, it looks amazing. <laughs> no pun intended, obviously, but yeah, look at that. The Celebi Amazing Rare. I'm going to get a close-up, just trying to fix the, make sure the camera's in focus here. But yeah, look at that. That is amazing. Looks great. So we'll get that right into a, take a look at the Colossal V. Get that right into a sleeve because <laughs> that makes me five out of six now. I just need the Jirachis, the last one I don't have. But look at that, guys. That is awesome. That's going to go right up in the background, even though you can't see it because we're too zoomed in, but... You can kind of see it blurred out there. Yeah, that is awesome. That's an amazing pull. All right, so another code card here. Maybe zoom out just a little bit. But there we go. One, two, three, four. I hope that is not the only pull we get in today's video, because like I said, I really want to pull one of the Pikachus. There we go, we are now in focus. The Stone Energy. Electric, Picky Peck, Mudbray, Joltik, Weedle, Taylo, Cottony, and a Galarian Perserker. Nothing amazing out of that pack. I'd like to know if you guys think the Elite Trainer Boxes have the, like, the best pull rate. Um, I haven't had the best of luck out of these things. I'm actually kind of surprised I even got an Amazing Rare out of this. Um, I feel like the Booster Boxes definitely have the better pull rate. Um, I've opened a couple Elite Trainer boxes and haven't really gotten like <laughs> um, anything, I guess. 
out of these. So I'm kind of curious what today, oh, nice Charmeleon, what today's pack looks going to be like. I know we got the Celebi and that's amazing, but we are looking for the Pikachu. Right now, uh, Vivid Voltage kind of feels a lot like Champion's Path for me because everyone knows the cards you're looking for. And I definitely did not pull any of the Charizards out of Champion's Path, even after, I mean, God knows how many packs I opened in that set, but still didn't get either of the two Charizards. And it's kind of the same way for this set for me. I opened up quite a few Vivid Voltage packs and haven't gotten, uh, well, I've gotten the Pikachu V Full Art. That's actually on my channel as well, if you want to go take a look at that. But I haven't pulled a VMAX or a VMAX Secret Rare, so that is what we're hunting for today. Got the Joltik, Sandile, Seedot, the Wisma Reverse, and what is the last card? An Orb Beetle V. So we're getting a lot of V cards. Um, we're still we're still in the first Elite Trainer box right now for pack wise. So we've actually gotten quite a few hits out of this one Elite Trainer box, which is kind of surprising. So maybe my my thoughts uh, when the set first came out was wrong. Maybe these Elite Trainer boxes have better pulls than I was expecting. Got the Fire Energy, Galvantula, Swellow, like that Pokemon, the Wash Energy, Yanma, Meow, Dusko, got the Voltorb, Weedle, the Literal Trash Reverse, and do we have a Pikachu after this card? No, but it is a Tornadus Hollow, so that's kind of cool. Very cool looking card. Not sure what he's grabbing at, but. He is doing some uh, some, court, uh, some sort of anime pose there. Looks kind of cool. But this is the last pack of our first half here. Um, and so far, I actually have to say, this first Elite Trainer Box is pretty good. Uh, the pull's been pretty decent. Um, which, like I said, really surprises me. Um, yeah, so this is the last pack. Let's see what we have inside. I wouldn't be surprised if we have a non hollow in the back here. Another Charmeleon, very nice. Pincurchin, Tynamo, getting lots of electric Pokemon, Execute, we have a Chatot, a Clubopus, Skiddo, oh, a Reverse Hollow Charmeleon, very nice, very nice. If you're going to get a uh, Reverse of any kind out of this set, it might as well be one of the, the Charmander, Charmeleon, or Charizard, because that is, you know, they're an expensive card, very nice. In the Flareon Reverse Hollow, so I did call that correctly. So in the first half, we got the Celebi Amazing Rare and a bunch of V cards. So we're gonna jump right into the second half of this video. If you haven't, uh, if you haven't already, consider hitting that like button, showing me a little bit of support. My channel is just getting started, but I would like to hit my goal of 50 subscribers before Christmas. I've always wanted to start a YouTube channel and. Um, this is the time that I'm doing it, so give me all the support that you can. I really do appreciate it. There's the Charmander. I saw that in the front of the pack. Got the Whooper, Meowth, Cottony, Aerocuda, the Mag Cargo, and what is in the first pack? Ooh, you know, I saw the yellow, and it made me believe for a slight second that we had a Pikachu, but it wasn't to be. Now, here's another question. If people watching the video have pulled a Pikachu VMAX or Rainbow, do you know how many packs it took you to do it? Because I feel like, I think I've opened, what is it now, one, two, three, maybe even four booster boxes, a bunch of build and battle boxes, and a bunch of elite trainer boxes, and I haven't pulled a single VMAX or Secret. I've been another Charmander, very nice. I also sell a lot of sealed product, and I have been told that two people have opened up uh, Pikachu B Maxes, Bear Scooter. Um, but nobody that I've sold to has told me that they pulled a Rainbow Pikachu. So I'm really, really curious what the overall, you know, what people think so far. You think it's easy? Is it hard? Obviously, it's hard. But like. Let me know how many packs it took you to actually pull the rainbow if you have pulled one. Nuzleaf. Got the opal. Her bay. I feel like my camera isn't quite. There we go. We got the literal trash. Tynamo. Clubopus. Woobat. Come on, there's gotta be a Pikachu in here somewhere. 
I need to have clickbait for the video. You have a Blitzel and Shift Tree non hollow. All right, so I think we're about halfway done. The second Elite Trainer Box. I hope maybe another amazing rare would save the video. If not, obviously I'm looking for the Pikachu. Come on, we can do this. We can do it together. Four cards to the front. We have the Fighting Energy. Giraffe Rig is also Giraffe Rig backwards, kind of like Ekans. We got the Dewat. Rock Ruff, kind of cute. <laughs> Wismer crying in a pool, not sure why. Yet again, we have Literal Trash. Then we have the Tynamo, Clubopus, seen him a couple times. The Reverse, Beedrill, and what is in the back of this pack? What is it gonna be? Ooh, a Zygarde Hollow. All right. So we have four packs left. I need to conjure up some energy here. Get my spirit bomb going. Let's go. One, two, three, four. And we got the fire energy. The Winden Stadium. Zeb Stryka. Excadrill. Chimeco. Ninkata. We got the Voltorb. Rock Ruff. Wismar crying in the pool. I think I've seen this pack before. And then we have the Giraffe Rig Reverse. Very nice. And a Metagross non hollow. So the second half of this opening has been worse than the first. But that was to be expected considering the first Elite Trainer Box had some decent pulls. So, like I said, if we can pull a Pikachu, this video will be saved. Four to the front. That is four. Yeah, okay. Sometimes I just can't count, you know? We have the Grass Energy, Kakuna, the Stinky Moo Moo Cheese, Sableye, the Picky Peck, <laughs> the, you know, Squirtle, but not. Got the Riolu, Chimeko, Ninkata, Genesect Reverse, okay, very nice. And, oh man, Manectric, all right. So the last two packs here, hopefully, we are building up into something insane. Let's please, please pull the Pikachu. Here's your code card. Four to the front. Let's give it a tap and a swirl. And that will be the Pikachu. Look, we have the Lightning Energy. This is a sign. We have the Sir Chester Bath, Galarian Stunfisk, Coding Energy, Ninkata, Picky Peck, Poochiana, Rockruff. Blitzel, Electros, Reverse, and we're gonna do this slowly. What is behind? Oh no, Exploud, non hollow So, like I said, this second half, I don't think, I think we've gotten one V card in the whole Elite Trainer Box. It has not been very good, so we have to, we have to come up clutch in this last pack. It's gotta happen. There's gotta be something in here. We have the code card. We have one, two, three, four. I will be taking this one much slower. All right, so we have the fighting energy. So if you made it to this far into the video, like I said, please consider subscribing to the channel, hitting that like button, leaving a comment down below and all the things we talked about. And yeah, we're gonna be getting into this last pack. Can we get some last pack magic? Can we get some last pack magic? I'll even tap the little button here on the, on the energy. All right, let's go. We have a Rocky helmet. We have an Alistair. All right, all right. Trainers. We got the Metang. Cool Pokemon. Another Rock Ruff. That's probably like our sixth one now. We got a Talo. Very nice. I'm actually playing through Omega Ruby right now, and I'm using a Talo in my team. We have a Yanma. A Whoop Purr. Sitting in a pool. Having a bath. A Dedenne. Come on, Pokemon. Let's... Or Arceus, I guess I should be asking him. Let's let's get something let's get something good here. Okay, so we got the Manectric Reverse Hollow. All right, let's try and hit 10 likes in today's video. And if we do, this is guaranteed to be a Pikachu behind this card. Let's see if we can do it. I know we can. All right, so it's gonna be something. It's such okay. Well, you know, I was saying this earlier. If you're gonna get something. In the last two cards of a pack, it might as well be a Charizard Evolution line because even this card is selling for like $10 a piece. And I think I, I have like 20 of these. So it's not a Pikachu. You know, it's not a Pikachu, but 
you know, um, it is a it is a Charizard rare. So this card is it's kind of hot right now. So I will take one of these any day of the week. I'd rather get this than another non-holo. You know. All right. So what I'm gonna do after at the end of every video, I do pick up all of the pulls. I don't show the hollows or uh, reverse hollows. I only show the V's or EX's and above, whatever the set you know num or set cards are called. So. We have the Ampharos V, we got the Orbeetle V. The V cards do look pretty cool. You have to give them some kind of, some, some kind of prop, you know? Colossal V, the Togekiss V, and my favorite card from today's opening, one of the amazing rares that I haven't had yet, the Celebi Amazing Rare. Look at that, beautiful. One of the, one of the coolest legendary Pokemon, you know? I'm a big fan of first through third gen of Pokemon and Celebi, when, whenever you're playing through gold and silver, trying to get a Celebi was like one of the biggest mysteries and when I was a kid anyway. But yeah, very cool, very cool. We didn't pull the Pikachu, but that just means in a later episode or a later video, we can pull a Pikachu then. So I hope you enjoyed. I hope you have a fantastic day. Um, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for hanging out, and I'll see you later. Peace out.